It's Vlogmas Day 22. We've received some cards. Thank you. Thank you. Again, charity cards. Thank you, Simon and Lisa. Thank you, Diane and Chewy. And now we're going to do a tag. Because Sean doesn't want to do the advents today. We're going to do the Christmas tag, babe. Mm -hmm. What's the first question? Because I can't see. First question is, what is your favourite movie? Oh, anything where I can breathe. Um, Elf. My favourite Christmas movie is Santa Claus the movie and then probably all of the old movies after that. Sean, are you on the naughty list or the nice list? Probably the naughty list because everybody hates me. I'm probably on the nice list, I would suspect. You're always on the nice list because you're a lovely person. Do you start your Christmas shopping on Black Friday or wait until the last minute? Before then, start like as and when I see stuff. Sean is a shopper. And then lots of stuff last minute when I just add more presents in. And I cannot stand shopping. Can't breathe in this. On Christmas Eve, what do you leave out for Santa? Usually an alcoholic beverage with a mince pie and a carrot. What she said. What is your favourite Christmas song? Oh. Feliz Navidad. <laughs> yep, we love Feliz Navidad. Um, I love Steel Eyed Spans, Gorte, um, Dulce Jule Blow, is that how you say it? By Michael Field. Mm -hmm. All those kind of older songs. What do you eat on Christmas Day? Food? Everything. Food? Everything. Generally, a veggie roast Christmas. Well, well, we'll start off with a glass of Asti. Oh, yes, a glass of Asti in the morning. Scrambled egg on toast for me. And I have scrambled egg and smoked salmon, so does Dad. And then dinner. Then it, chocolate. No, and more chocolate. Sean and has more chocolate. chocolate. I don't have chocolate. Um, then we would normally have a starter, which may be a prawn cocktail or a smoked salmon cocktail for me. Then we have a dinner with all the trimmings. Yep. We're getting it from the stables this year. We, we were supposed to be eating out the same as last year, but we are collecting the food and warming it up here instead. And I not, can't remember what I ordered. Probably turkey. Yeah, and Sean likes lots of pigs and blankets, stuffing and roast potatoes. Lots of roast pigs and potatoes. blankets. Pigs and blankets, roast potatoes, stuffing, they're my favourite part. If you could be in any Christmas movie, what would it be? Santa Claus the movie. Um, um, um. Die Hard. No, Home Alone 2, because I want to go to New York. Oh, good answer. Name all of Santa's reindeer. There's re so there's Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. Had a very shiny nose. And if you ever saw him. Dancer? Dancer, Prancer. Prancer. Prancer dan oh, you've got Prancer, Dancer, Donner, Vixen, Blitzen, Comet, Comet Cupid. Have I named them? Dasher. I said Dasher. I said Prancer. Dan Dancer, Dancer. Dancer. Comet, uh, Comet Vixen. Vixen, Dasher, Cupid, Blitzen, Comet. There we go. I think that's the one. Oh, I've lost my questions. Like I lose my mind. I'm losing my marbles. I think I've lost my mind. <laughs> you quackers, me. You are quackers. When does your family put up your Christmas tree and who decorates it? We normally go by the 12 days of... the, the tw Is it 12 days before, 12 days after rule? Ish. Ish. This year it's been slightly different. And because we left the heat on one day, our tree is dying. It, yeah, it's Already. Dead. It's very droopy. It's limp. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? Real. Real. Always like real trees. Yeah. Peeking at gifts or to be surprised. I like surprises. He's a peeker. No, I like to be surprised as well, but I do like to have a little bit of guesswork. Like, I'll, I'll give it a shake, I'll give it a feel. He spoils Sometimes, all, occasionally, he's, just the odd thing. He spoils all the fun for me. No, I don't. Yes, you do. That's part of the fun for me. Does your family have a special holiday tradition? Yes, my family when, would always go up to Cowell's the Garden Centre to have a look at the Christmas um, decorations and buy a Christmas decoration and buy a tree from Cowell's. Um, always watch Santa Claus the movie on Christmas Eve. Or the, the, Dad always has pork and pickles. I always have cheese and pickles. Um, Christmas pyjamas. Christmas pyjamas. Yeah. Christmas candles. Um, yeah, we have 
a few traditions. Oh, I'm get, this is uh, giving me a headache. We'll take it off. No. What tops your tree? An angel, which has fallen off right now. An angel, sorry, I meant to say a star, which has fallen off right now. It used to be an angel. Yeah. Uh, do you make New Year's resolutions and do you stick to them? Not really. And not really. I don't. Uh, do they make New Year's resolution? No. I hope my. I think my my New Year's resolution is always not to be too soft. But then I can't help being too soft. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's all the questions. That's all the questions. I'm thank you. I feel like I'm going to pass out. Thank you to the Kershaw's Adventures for tagging us. Oh yes, thank you, thank you, guys, man. Um, we're not going to do the advent calendars today because I feel like I'm going to pass out. That's better. I can breathe. Advents? Oh, no, Santa. Hello. No, we're not going to bother with the advents today. You're, uh, you're all a bit bored of them anyway. It's only the electronics one, which you'll see on Christmas Eve. I'll build that. Um, and we'll do the Nivea and Bia ones tomorrow doubled up. You'll build it this time next year. Happy birthday, Paul! Yes, happy birthday, Paul, of that UK Disney couple! On you, just penguin-tastic! He's not. He is. You. Me? Oh, what's penguin tastic? I've no idea. I just made it up. That describes Paul. Do you like the beard? He's like a penguin. He loves slapping about. Today's charity of the day is the Elders Danlaw Support UK. The reason I've chosen this is because our good friend Stacy has it. I know of quite a few other people who have it. And a new fan family member has it as well. I'm suspected to have it. I haven't had the test because they only do them if you have family members who have it. Um, but I, ha I, haven't, I haven't had the test. I do know that I've got the joint hypermobility side of it. That has definitely been diagnosed. They really do need money because it's such a rare health issue and it has to be specially looked into with special tests to be diagnosed. So what's the charity called? The Elmer's Dan Elmer's Danlos Society. Oh, org. It's a mouthful. Just EDS for short. That's our charity of the day. Keep making merry. Catch you later.